You're literally just like a foot off the ground. If you have me to tape, I can do it. Well, we have to start from the corner. All right. <laughs> Welcome back to my channel. As you can see, I'm surrounded by tons of boxes, and that's because my office at Maison des Jeunes is in the middle of renovations. I just bought a condo. I'm currently at my new condo, and because I can't work at Maison des Jeunes, I'm setting up my office here. But before I set up my office, I have to paint, organize all this, so I figured you guys could join me for the ride. And Munchkin, of course, is here to help out. <laughs> Well, you've got two inches on me, so <laughs> it's gonna be your job. <laughs> I'll do all the lower bits. I'm too short to reach the ceiling. As am I. Oh, I don't like this. And we need to tape this so I don't want to <laughs> paint on the ceiling. You're literally just like a foot off the ground. If you have me to tape, I can do it. Well, we have to start from the corner. All right. <laughs> can we just start in the middle of the wall? <laughs> okay. <laughs> the funny thing is, yesterday my dad's like, do you want to hire staff on? I was like, no, oh, shit, we're fine. So, I need to show the paint, and then you can make a stir stick. So we're improvising. Hopefully, this fork will work. All right. That's a nice gray. I wasn't sure about the color when I picked it, but I like it. So I actually didn't want to paint this myself and got a quote, whoops, got a quote from a paint company. And these crazy people wanted to charge me $4,000 to paint an 800 square foot unit. And I laughed at them and I was like, no, thank you, bye. So in the end, because I just don't really want to paint my whole place, I'm just doing two or three accent walls. So I'll have two or three gray accent walls and the rest will stay white. But I will spruce up my balcony next summer. I just feel like there's no point in doing it now for September. Uh, so next year I'll probably put like fake green grass, <laughs> Ooh. put nice little uh, bistro tables, two chairs. So we're almost done. We just have that little corner left to do of the first coat. Then I'm gonna leave for a few hours and then come back, do the second coat. Um, and then tomorrow all my furniture arrives, so I'm gonna set up. So in the coming days, oh, there's a little piece of lint on the wall. Uh, so yeah, so in the coming days, my place will be almost set up, so I'm really excited. My back's feeling great that we're about to be done. <laughs> <laughs> but it really wasn't that bad. Didn't no. take that long. So we finished painting the main wall in my living room and you'll notice the stellar job that we did with the taping. So I'm going to have to go in and touch that up because let's be real, that looks atrocious. But I mean for the most part considering Munchkin and I are not professionals, it looks decent. I could be bothered to unpack any more of these boxes. I've been living in, I've been living on top of boxes and I'm just done. We just finished painting the wall in my den and the final thing that we're going to do before we wrap up for the day is hang up these beautiful paintings that I got. This is good. So I've been in my place for a few months now and I'm slowly getting everything set up. Because of the pandemic, so much furniture is on back order, so I've been waiting for my bookcase to arrive for several months. It's finally here, so I'm gonna set it up. I'm almost set up in my space to be able to work from home. So enjoy watching me put this together. Hopefully it's gonna be straightforward and easy. We'll see, fingers crossed. All right. Whoa, I love how you like roped you into this. <laughs> Come film slash aka help me set up a bookcase. Alright, so what's the first step? 
Oh, we're starting with step nine. <laughs> All right, good choice. <laughs> so you need this guy, the side panel, which is 16 and 17. Okay, so I think, yes, so the handle will go on the front here. Grab it. I wanted to do the drawers first because it looked like it was the hardest part, and it clearly yeah. is. <laughs> Yay! Now that the drawers are done, Right. Next step is we're gonna put the backing onto this side. And then something like this probably goes on top. I mean, I'm assuming it's this. It looks like it's the same. Or something like this. Yes, you are, you are correct. I think. Yeah. I'm talking about it. Oh, okay. I see, 13. Okay, we're getting there. Yep. Speed round. Yep. <laughs> oh no, this is the front, so we want it like a bit. Okay. Yeah, that's gonna be on that side. Alright, nice. Okay. And now we could lay on top. Yeah, exactly. And lift. Okay, so we finally finished building this. It took a little bit longer than I had anticipated, so now I'm gonna move this into my office. So as I was trying to put the drawers in, I realized that I made a little mistake. So these have been installed on the opposite side, so I just need to take these off and put them on the other side. So I basically need to remove six screws, swap the sides of these and then the drawers will blend properly. So I just rearranged everything so the drawers should slide in properly now. Yay! Success!